desert southwest doesn't exactly conjure up thoughts of exotic or even scary marine life. That is until now. Hello and welcome to another edition of Electric TV. As always, I'm your host, Dominic Giratano. Imagine a make-believe world where Walt Disney meets Jacques Cousteau. Well, a perfect place for such a meeting might very well be the Odyssey Aquarium, a very real place soon to open in Scottsdale, Arizona. And when it does, it will educate and entertain visitors in ways unlike anything they've ever experienced before. And the Nika IBEW team is helping to make it possible. The Odyssey Aquarium will feature 48 exhibits spread throughout a two-story, 200,000 square foot theme park. But before the doors open, there is still quite an impressive list of work that must be completed. Systems that need to be installed and tested to support more than a million and a half gallons of fresh water and seawater, all circulating in a variety of tanks kept at different and precise temperatures. More than 300 pumps need to be wired to move the water and power the filtration systems. There will be moving walkways and a carousel that circles spectators around select exhibits. That's before we even mention the design and installation of some mind-blowing specialty lighting. And if that doesn't sound like a challenge, the entire building is built on a radius. There's not a, a straight line on this entire project. So we really had to look at the current technology, knowing that you could not pull a tape measure anywhere off of a grid line or a column. So what we utilize is the BIM model for the entire layout of this project. It's one of the most complicated projects that we've had, specifically substructure and then above ground as well. Because there are no square rooms, no perpendicular angles, the construction of Odyssey just wouldn't happen without building information modeling. Everything lives on a computer or an iPad, all showing designs built to one thirty-second of an inch tolerance. No need to plumb bob, no need for a crew to carry tape measures. They'll have them with them because that's part of the habit, but absolutely they will leave their tape measures at home and they'll rely specifically on the model. You basically are building the building twice. You build it in a virtual world, every bends uh, for conduits, every rack systems, all of that stuff gets built into a model. So all your measurements and stuff are all done. And then you get to use that model and you go back out to the field and you do it again. KNF is really a, an engineering based electrical contractor. We have electrical engineers in office here and in St. Louis. And with that engineering expertise, we're able to take on more difficult projects more uh, industrial projects and, and complex projects. And that's really what our core focus is, is on unique projects that are more engineering based. We have uh, been coordinating all the necessary uh, tenant improvement uh, requirements and all the electrical that needs to provide the powers for the pumps, for the life support, and 60 different monitors throughout the space specialty lighting and everything that needs to power, you know, from air condition to everything else that we do. Besides the obvious coordination and productivity benefits of building information modeling or BIM is that it lets the customer see at any given time where the construction should be and where it actually is. When it comes to the NECA IBEW team, pride and professionalism are on display. Very much so. I looked at their productivity and the milestone that uh, we set out uh, to do. NECA IBEW spends millions of dollars every year training our workforce. We believe we have the best trained workforce out there and this type of job is perfect for showing how we can do a complex job. Our working relationship with the IBEW is tremendous. Um, their training, their education support, our safety support, all helps us do what we do, and uh, without, without that commitment from the IBEW, we wouldn't be successful. The culture that we have here is that, that we're here to make our employers successful, but even more so to make their, their customers successful and have a, have a great project for them at the end. Uh, by cooperating with, with NECA, uh, by being more productive, uh, we make that happen every day. Uh, and through our code of excellence, uh, the members have bought into that, 
and the contractors have bought into that and that's just a standard in our industry right now. Well the IBW are doing a great job out there really putting the work in place and we trust the work they're doing and we kind of just monitor them and, and they're doing a great job for, for KNF as far as the overall installation. This is not another office building. It's a specialty type of undertaking on behalf of uh, the subcontractor. The cost of doing that um, is really relative to the value that I get. I guess uh, you get what you pay for. The Odyssey Aquarium represents a big investment for the owner with a big goal to match. 18 million tourists visit this part of the country every year, and this new theme park hopes to be a destination for thousands of them every day. It's certainly also getting the attention of the four million plus residents that live here. It, it definitely is fun. We're, most, most of our projects are, are pretty low profile. We do a lot of waste treatment, water treatment plants, that kind of thing. So they're pretty low profile and this here has definitely been a, a great to be a part of. I got grandkids, man. I can't wait to show them stuff in here, you know? That is going to be quite the experience. That'll do it for this edition. Make sure to follow us on social media for industry information and behind-the-scenes extras. We'll see you next time.